object casting in java what do we mean by object casting in java and if we want to implement object casting then what are the several conditions we need to follow hello everyone i am sukanya from goedu hub technologies and in this video we are going to discuss about object casting in java now assigning one data type to another or one object to another is known as casting java supports two type of casting that is data type casting and object casting now there are several conditions for object casting and those are same class object can be assigned to one another that means if there are one or more objects in a same class then only they can be assigned to each other or can be casted subclass object can be assigned to the superclass object and this casting is done implicitly it is also known as upcasting that means upward in the hierarchy from the subclass to the superclass but java does not permit to assign a superclass object to subclass object implicitly and still to do so we need explicit casting this is known as downcasting or superclass to subcast downcasting requires explicit conversion and java does not permit that kind of casting so here is a code you can see that a superclass is created name is flower and it is having smell method and as that method is called it is going to an print ln statement is written that all flower gives smell if you can smell now there is a subclass rose which extend the superclass flower it also has the same method that is smell and it print that rose gives rosy smell next in the void main method you can see that there is a object of flower class created f and similarly for rose created r and then both the objects are called with the help of smell method now you can see that this is a casting then f is equals to r that means this is sub subclass to superclass it is valid this kind of casting is valid and this casting is known as upcasting which we have studied and java supports upcasting upwards in the hierarchy from subclass to the superclass and then f dot smell method is called but r equals to f this particular calling is not valid because superclass to subclass calling or casting is not valid in java next you can see that there is explicit casting made for that and f dot smell is done with the help of that particular class we have done the explicit class casting for down casting and then smell method is called and then the output is displayed so let us firstly execute the program and see that how the output occurs so here you can see that i have written the pro program and save my particular code file as flower.java so i'm going to execute that particular compile that firstly and then i'm going to run the class file that is rose is the particular class file and i'm going to run that and you can see the output that all flowers give smell if you can smell and then the explicit casting and then the implicit casting method is done so this is how casting is done in java this type of casting is only preferred when a subclass to superclass is done that is upcasting but downcasting we have to do it explicitly so this is the concept of object casting in java for more concepts and programs of java we will look into upcoming videos thank you